The royal family traditionally spends Christmas together at Sandringham but after a monumental year and recent rumors of rifts, will we see Meghan Markle spending it with Kate, Fergie and Camilla? Like most people at Christmas, the royals spend the festive holidays eating, exchanging gifts, and watching the Queen's speech. Prince Charles, Prince William and Prince Harry usually attend Christmas at Sandringham, the Queen's 20,000-acre country estate in Norfolk. Meghan Markle spent her first Christmas with the monarchy there last year, stepping out with Harry, William and Kate for a service at St. Mary Magdalene Church. The so-called Fab Four looked happy and relaxed as were pictured together, a few months before Harry and Meghan tied the knot in May at Windsor. But in recent weeks, Speculation has grown of a widening rift between Kate and Meghan. Meghan has been branded Duchess Difficult, reportedly making the Duchess of Cambridge cry at a bridesmaid dress fitting for Charlotte before her wedding. One royal biographer Christopher Wilson even claimed it could cause an ordeal for the Duchess of Cambridge this Christmas at Sandringham. But this has been dismissed by former royal household butler Grand Herald who says he doubts very much that a rift exists, he told Express Co. UK. Whether or not this is true, it will not affect the royal Christmas as they are there as guests and both know the etiquette of being a guest in one's home. Mr. Harold said he expects both Kate and Meghan to be at Sandringham with their royal spouses as would be expected. Referring to pregnant Meghan spending her second Christmas away from her native America, he added, I am sure though that they will make the Duchess feel very much at home and I am sure she will have a wonderful Christmas there. Will Sarah Ferguson and Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall be there? 2018 has been full of celebration with two royal weddings, the birth of Prince Louis and the Prince of Wales' 70th birthday. And it was also the year Sarah Ferguson was publicly welcomed back into the royal fold. Prince Andrew's ex-wife appeared to revel in a return to the limelight at her daughter Princess Eugenie's wedding, also at Windsor Castle, in October. Mr. Harold says the Duchess of York has a wonderful relationship with the royal family, despite her well-documented feud with Prince Philip, so could be there. But he said he couldn't confirm for certain, adding, Let's wait for the Christmas Day church service to see who the guests are. Traditionally, although she remains close to her ex-husband Andrew and two children, Fergie does not attend the Christmas celebrations with the rest of the royals in Sandringham. Speaking to the Daily Mail, Fergie revealed how she really feels about spending Christmas apart from daughters Princess Beatrice and Princess Eugenie every year. She explained she often turns the television on to see her daughters on Christmas Day, saying, I will watch Ben-Hur and really enjoy it, then watch the news and see how the girls are doing. I know that Her Majesty adores my children, so I am happy to share them, both in August and at Christmas, she added. I really am like this. I love to share. It's the joy of giving. Camilla Parker Bowles, who also now spends Christmas at Sandringham, could be a support for Meghan having previously spoken warmly of her engagement to Harry. Speaking at the time, the Duchess said, it's brilliant and as I said, America's loss is our gain. We are all absolutely delighted.